What is going on YouTube? It is 5.30 right now. I woke up with an alarm at five o'clock. Yesterday was daylight saving, so maybe that messed me up a bit. Honestly, I don't mind. 5 a.m. is still super early and I feel very rested. We're gonna get into some chest biceps today. I was gonna do arms, but I remembered that I am leaving to go to the base body works factory from Tuesday night to Thursday night. So I probably won't be working out when I'm there. So I wanna hit Today's Monday, I'm gonna hit chest buys today, back tries tomorrow, and then I'll pretty much be good on volume for the week. Anyways, picked up some more cream of rice, gonna eat some honey and a banana, and I'll see you at the gym. Starting off on the floor again. You guys already know this exercise, and again, with the straps, put it in like so, and hold it, so then, you're pretty much all the weight is on your wrist. Again, bro, this machine feels really good. All the machines here are like peak in peak condition. All right, we're gonna do our first working set and I will probably start sipping my pre here in a sec. It's about six o'clock, so it's been an hour since I woke up. I'm pretty sure you're supposed to wait like an hour and a half. All right, here we go. do some chest pressing and I'm excited because they have four different hammer strength chest machines. Let's try them out. Starting off with the incline hammer machine press. Gonna do one more warm-up set of this. Probably throw in the 25s. See if I can get maybe six. I think I've been failing around like five to six. So if I can get six reps, that's good. Uh, let's just gauge this weight real quick. Notice when I, I'm gonna unrack it and then kind of set and then press. I'm not just gonna press from the beginning. You could put like a yoga block there, but I'm lazy. Seven, maybe? I lost count. Let's go. I think my acne is starting to clear up a bit. Also, if you're wondering why my hair looks like shit in the mornings, well, I have bed head, and then I also brush it out. So I brush out all my curls, and then just I rinse it after I work out to reset it so it looks good throughout the day. Only the OGs on this channel will know what my like bed head and shitty hair looks like. Every other platform, they only see me when I'm locked in with some nice locks. Anyways, I dropped the weight. Even though I think I got seven reps that time, plus like four partials. If I did the same weight, I would probably only be able to get four or five, I think. So maybe next time I'll do two working sets with 275, but for now I'm just gonna drop the weight and get some high reps, really focus on the eccentric and the stretch and the contraction. I need to find another song. Spider-Man, let's go. <laughs>
This is I expected. I failed at like seven. So imagine if I had 15 more pounds on each side. I normally have to do incline smith, but honestly, I want to try out another one of these machines. So this might be a shoulder press, but I think with the way I set it up, I'm still going to get some chest activation. Either way, let's just send it. I think the difference between this one and the other one is just the resistance profile, but I'm down to try it. So, yeah, it's definitely a different resistance profile. All right, this should be working set one of two. Definitely a shoulder machine. <laughs> First bicep exercise. Wait for next set. Another set of regular curls. We'll finish off with the hammers at the end. Um, then I'm gonna take some intra carbs, Coach Keeb. And then we're gonna go do chest fly. Then we'll go hit lateral raises again. And then we'll go hit preacher curls to finish off the workout. And I'll probably do a bit of forearms. Same workout every week, just trying to progress with the movements we're doing. old school pec deck flies and it doesn't converge so remember how I was saying you want to bring the elbows in like this to kind of fit like a pec press fly can't do it on this one but it feels pretty good so we're gonna try it out today if I don't like it next time we'll just do cable flies yeah this is the form I'm gonna be rocking with <laughs> just pumping that shit yeah I might have to stick with this machine, honestly. I don't really know how I'm gonna get a good angle on this because this is right in front of the mirror. I'm just gonna do two sets of this. Get cinematic with it.
All right, excluding forearms, this is our last exercise. Two sets, you know the drill. Drop the weight and drop the seat a little bit. I never do this, but I want to do a drop set. I just want more blood in the muscle. Performance is pretty simple. I'm just going to do like two sets of curls. I do my extension stuff on my arm day, but yeah, I've heard that it's more beneficial to train this side for size than extension, so I'm gonna do more. Same with your neck, you're supposed to do more curls than extensions for neck size. We'll add some weight and then just use two sets of curls to failure. You're supposed to be doing these in a lower rep range, but the problem is like, I literally cannot hold on to it if it's a lower rep range. So I generally go like 10 to 15 reps. Do another set of that and call it. was a better set. Okay. I've been doing this for a week, holy shit. This is day seven. I will see you all tomorrow with Shaw for Back and Tries. You know I would throw it all away. I just keep on wishing that the money